What's up, you guys? Sasha Boss here, and today I'm giving my full review of Narnia, the Magician's Nephew. I finished this book a span of tw of two days. Started yesterday. I my opened up the series. I read this the first day, which I loved it. I read the second part today. We'll finish the book today. I absolutely adore the story. It's so good. So let's go on and talk about the story. So I'm gonna go fast due to I don't have storage on my phone. But the story pretty much takes place in the beginning with Polly and uh, Diggory, um, which became the professor and the Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe. Mine spo also spoilers since if you haven't been paying attention. But in the first book, on the first part of the book, Polly and um, Polly meets Diggory in the park, and they spend the whole summers together, like they did in, um, and then they went to the attic, which is the house between how houses and went to the tunnel and they found um uncle andrew's um well i think uncle andrew's serious study room and they found the rings and the rings took them to the world between worlds where they brought a witch which is briefly um in the book and then they took the witch all the way uh, back to london back to earth and the witch is now uh, attacking uh, London, which is my favorite part in the book, uh, she came running around with the horses. I thought it was funny, as funny as heck. I absolutely adored that scene. But and then they brought the witch to Narnia, and then I'm gonna explain what happens. And then they got the apple, and then the apple. Um, yeah, they got the apple. I'm gonna spoil more of the book for you guys. You gotta read it yourself to figure out what happens. But did I like this? But did I like this book? Heck yeah! It was so good! It felt like an actual adventure book. And I felt like I was watching Netflix, but reading a book. And I love the rings. Briefly, the rings um, take you from puddles. Uh, the green brings you back, and the yellow um, takes uh, takes you um, there. Well, and vice versa, I mean. Green takes you back, and yellow takes you there. And I adored it. I adored that whole scene. That was cool, and Polly and and uh, they really like did that, and then took Uncle Andrew there. And one thing about Uncle Andrew, one of my favorite characters, he literally didn't believe Aslan was real, which I thought was funny. Uh, the whole character thought Aslan was real, and Diggory um was also a cab driver who was with him and a horse named Strawberry, which I love. Strawberry the horse, he got wings, so I love that. And also the funny thing about Diggory, uh. Oh, not Diggory, the cabbie, he actually became a king of Narnia. And he reminds me of Mr. Gibbs. I have no idea why he reminds me of Mr. Gibbs, but he did. He reminds me of Mr. Gibbs. And I absolutely adore this whole book. It explains like how Narnia was created, which is my favorite part in the book. Because it talks about how, how Aslan sung a song that created all, all the animals th through, through Narnia. Which I adored. I, I really appreciate it. I don't want to spoil more, but like, the professor grows up in this rich house because the dad came back from India because the uncle died and they inherited all the money. And then Polly comes to visit him each holiday. What happened to Polly afterwards? I want to know more. She's not in the, any of the other books besides this book. And the professor is not only in the other book, but like, the whole professor's story, I feel like it should be more of his youth. But like, when he got older, he built a wardrobe that it took. Took Lucy, um, Heavens through the um, to Narnia to Miss Mr. Thomas, and the witch is still there. And the, he struck a bell, and the witch is there. I'm like, it was so good. I highly recommend this book. Uh, my favorite part of the whole book is the creation of Narnia, and then the pool jump. The pool jump was cool with the rings and finding Polly and just exploring the ruins and then find uh, unleashing the witch. I love the witch. Oh my gosh, she's so cool. I'm seeing the first two movies, Prince of Caspian, and um, Magician's Nephew, uh, no, Prince Caspian and, and Lion, Witch, and Wardrobe, I watched the movies, so I know what's happening, but this is the line, The Wish, and the Wardrobe, uh, I'll read this, probably takes me two days, love the cover art, um, briefly it says Narnia, uh, here's the read-up, you can, pa read you can pause the video here, um, to read it, so, there's that. I at the end of the day, I'm going to say this is the best way to start a new series, in my opinion. Help me think of other things besides COVID-19 and the whole United States. And it was a rainy day, so why not read a book? And 10 out of 10, a really boss book. So, um, for Narnia, 
and thanks for watching uh, Sasha Boss and like and subscribe.